This is part three of section 3.4. I want to create a truth table for this statement here. It is a biconditional at the end, and I need to figure out each side before I can do that. I don't have a negation of a simple term here, so I'm gonna jump right in to P or R. And if it's or, as long as I have a true statement, it is true. So I'm looking at P and R, so the first column and the third column. True or true is true. True or false is true. True or true is true. True or false, that's true. False or true is true. False or false, that one's false. False or true is true. And false or false is false. Okay. So I figured out this part. Now I'm going to go into side this set of parentheses. So that is Q and R. Now with and, it's only true when they're both true. And I'm looking at Q and R, so these two columns. True and true is true. True and false, that's false. That's false. That one's false. This one's true false, false, and false. Now we need to negate this. So this is not Q and R. So I just change each of these. So false, true, 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 tr uh, false, false there. True, true, and true. Yeah, that's, I'm double checking because I made one stupid mistake. I think that's correct. Okay, so now finally we have each piece. We are ready to do the biconditional. So I'm ready for P or R. The biconditional, not Q and R. So it's a biconditional using this statement and this one. And remember with a biconditional, we need to, they need to have the same truth value. So since I have a true and a false here, this is false. They're the same here, so true, true, true. They're different, so false, false. That one's true and that one is false. Okay. Now for our next problems, it's like we're doing a single line from a truth table. We are told our truth values. The P statement is false, the Q statement is true, and the R statement is false. So basically, if P is false, I have false, true, false, I'm essentially doing this line, false, true, false. Okay, but I can just do it underneath. So what I'm gonna do first I'm going to write this a little bit big, but I'm just going to write, you know, the F and the T for these with the, with the symbol still in there. So P is false, so I'm going to do false, and my R is false, so I have false and false. Conditional and Q is true. And I want to know overall whether this statement is true or false. So I'm just going to build it up kind of the same way we did. If I have false and false with and, it needs to be true and true in order to have a true. And so this first statement is false. So I have if false, then true. And remember, for a conditional, if your first statement is false, the overall statement is true. So with these truth values, this statement is true. Okay. Now I'm going to do the same thing here. I have not P. So P was false, so not false. That's going to be true. If and only if, parentheses, not Q. Q was true, so not Q is false. And R 
R is false. So false and false. Do this here, that's an and, so uh, false and false is false. So I have t true if and only if false. Remember with a biconditional, they need to be the same in order to be true, and they are not. So this overall statement is false with the given truth values. Okay, one more here. I have a lot going on, so I really am going to spread this out quite a bit. I have not, bracket, parentheses, not P. So not P, P was false, so I'm going to write true here. Actually, just so I don't have to keep sliding it back up and down. That will help. Okay, so not P would be true, then R, which is false, close parentheses, by conditional, and then P, which is false, or not Q, so that is false. Okay, so now I'm gonna work inside these parentheses. I'm gonna keep this not until the very end. That, that's gonna be my last step because everything else is inside, well, brackets or parentheses essentially. So on the conditional, if I have true, if true, then false. This is the only case where the conditional is false. If and only if. False or false. With or, it is true if there is a true in there. Otherwise, it's going to be false. Since both of these are false, this is false. Now, the biconditional is true when they have the same value. So I have not true. So your overall answer is false.